Alright, if you're here, it's because you're having trouble with Origin launching games. So, at the moment, there's a huge issue, if you're not aware, where Origin is currently updating to their horrible, fucking, ridiculously terrible app uh, from EA. Okay? Uh, let's just say it, most of the games that it tries to run literally doesn't work, and this issue has existed for well over a month. So, a couple workarounds have been devised. Uh, this is not from me. I did not try to develop this workaround. He did, actually. P0358. Apparently, he's a developer for a mod and whatnot uh, for Titanfall, I believe. Um, I did make this. I'm just here to make a video to make to help people do it easier. Most videos like this uh, are kind of shit in that they, they're, very, they're way too fucking long and they're not, they can't read very well. Um, so, this is going to be the, this is going to be the thumbnail. Um... This, you could pause the video if you need to, but basically, is what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna want to down is make sure you uninstall through add and remove, right? Um, uninstall EA, right? And as you can see, I don't have EA installed, um, but you want to install both Origin and EA. Make sure you don't have either of them installed. Now, for whatever reason, um, you have an issue where uh, it's you follow these steps and it's not working. Uh, what you're gonna want to do is you're going to want to go to um, your, your what amounts to your local app data and you can do this very easily um easiest way to do it really is just it's just windows key and r and type this and i'll open up this folder and then you want to down then you want to delete send setup now mine is working just fine so i'm not fucking with it right it's kind of a pain in the ass so i'm not deleting it but that's an idea what you can do um all of this shit will be in the description of course if you have any problems um so you want to download the full version make sure you download full okay if you don't download full it's not going to work then you're going to install a normal. You're going to come up to a screen like where you have to log in. Don't log in. Exit it out. Close it from the taskbar. Make sure it's closed. Then what you want to do is go to your um, is go to your C drive. Okay, because so that's where it by default goes. Now, um, the folder we need is hidden folder. So if you actually need to be able to see it, what you do is you go to view and hidden items. Your operating system may vary, so um, if you need to figure out how to you know view hidden items through your operating system, just do a quick Google search, man. It takes like 10 seconds. And then you want to go to program data and you want to scroll down find origin now there's a couple ways of doing this um the quote, quote easiest way really is just to open this up with like notepad right um oh fuck off edge lamau imagine edge being imagine eggs existing um and you can do this very easily oh, God, imagine it opening with edge um like with notepad right and so uh no, this is where this is where we start, um, and you can just paste an image between. Now, I don't know if you guys know anything about Conan. Most people probably don't. If they're having to watch this. Make sure if you post any, paste any settings, you do so between the actual two settings. Otherwise, it, it won't work. Trust me, it just won't. Um, another easy, another way of doing it, if you, like you really don't feel like dealing with that, it's only honestly downloading this. This is the version I edited myself, and I works. This is the version I'm literally using, and it's working. Um, now, if for whatever reason. In the future, uh, if anyone's watching this and it's like a year or whatever down the line, and there's not, it's nothing's working for you. Um, I have, in fact, like I have archi I have archived these downloads here, and those will be in the description as well. Um, so in theory, you should be able to do it regardless if uh, if the current version of Orange that you're able to get a hold of doesn't work. Um, so just make sure you check the description. If there's any updates, let me know. Um, and you're gonna have it installed. Now, once you do this workaround. What's going to happen is that annoying banner that pops up whenever you activate or you open up Origin isn't going to be here anymore. Now, this is very important. Don't try to launch your Origin games through Steam. It won't work. At worst case scenario, best case scenario, it won't work. But worst case scenario, we'll try to update. Don't fucking do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. So you want to go to your your game library and try to play the game. Now, um, like some other people might experience, um, because of the way that they're that they set up. Um, or but between the way they set up origin there, there's a bug where sometimes steam will think the game is installed when it's not so the best solution for that is you go to your steam library like for example i had to do this with mass effect as a matter of fact you go to properties and then you want to go to local files you want to verify integrity just to make sure everything is there um because i've had like, literally i had a time where i was doing this for a long time and it wasn't working and it turns out it's that steam didn't actually fully install the game it was supposed to um, now you can you can verify integrity here just fine. That won't so that won't be a problem because of the way the game works. And then you just launch everything through, through Origin, and as you can see, I can play the game just fine. All right. Now, if you have any other questions or anything like that, feel free to let me know. I'll put put it in the description box or sorry the uh, comment section, and I'll be able to help you best I can.